Hello everyone, Digfig here, and welcome back to some more Outer Worlds. Left off uh, talking to Hivius, and what's her name? And killing her and killing all the gods, and now we're here. Great recap, never been better. Thank you, we are now on Hope. Gotta skip this thing across the system, do some fancy stuff nonetheless here. I wonder if I turn in Phibius, if I have an option to rescue him from the jail. I would explain the high security prison area. Um, what the hell are these guys? Corporate to recruit. Their armor looked weird, but that's just what they are. Off with your head. Off with your head. Your head. Oh, I missed one. Touche. Yeah. What do you think you do? You're not really gonna get down on anything, my friend. You dead. Y'all dead. And you're screaming like a little bitch about it. Oh, what ship is that over there? Or is that just part of the hope outside? This place, this ship is really, really fucking big. It's like, I know they say how many people are in here and stuff, but like, if that's my ship, this place is massive. Um, pretty sure this is our first time on the hope. I don't remember being on here at any other point really because <clears throat> we're still in our cryopod the first time so it's definitely our first time here we get full clear the hope yeah yeah, yeah i'll talk to this thing um uh, patch okay power is now being right from the docking bay reactor in our power mode status Power status, UDL retraining is remote. The following modules are now operational. Life support, engines, navigation, communication, security. Uh, maintenance status, engines, 22,000 days overdue. 22,100 days overdue. Ooh, someone's done that more recently. Um, 2236, 2298, security, skip drive, 21. That's like the newest thing someone's done. Interesting. Um, territorial microwave short circuited after some idiot left the fork on his plate. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, microwave clock is stopped, is stuck on high power mode, has stopped working entirely. Continue hibernation storage status. Um, 99, 92, 97. Continue. Okay. Logs. Pre launch roll call. Captain and first man. Uh, okay. Manual log. Longest trip Don and I have ever took was a week long sojour. Sojour? Sojourner? I don't even know what word that is. Into the Silver Mountains, even that set our, her on edge. She's a homebody, always was. She packed so much food we couldn't have been. We could have been stranded out there on those rocks for a month and we probably would have been just fine. UDL sent us on a team building simulator into the city once. They paid for everything. Donna still packed nutrient bars just in case the bus broke down. Good for her. It's going to take the ship 10 years to reach Halcyon in an entire decade. It's a good thing UDL provided the rations, else you might have dumped our life savings into mixed nuts and freeze-dried meat. I have nothing about wrong being too prepared sometimes. Um, this is it, folks. Say goodbye to the old blue, huh? Yeah, if anyone wants to. Good riddance. Why so bitter, Rez? She's going... She's been a good home. Give me a spaceship any day of the week. Well, well, see how you feel in a year. So, a um, moment of silence, or should we make a toast? Anything? It feels weird leaving Earth in the rearview mirror. No, from now on, we only look forward. Hey, I'm not a good dad, did you? Um, yeah, I turned it on. Thanks. Thanks for informing me. Um, yes, Vicar. You know, I have, I'm an engineer, I'm a medical dude, I'm a scientist, but all my points into those things were fancy in those departments, and uh, you're going to tell me how things are going. It's fine, Vicar. I understand you got some hacking skills yourself and some engineering skills yourself, but you're also a Vicar, so I should be a little bit easier on you there. I need to kill some folk over here, pick up his stuff, combat drone, combat rifle, you know don't know the last time I repaired all my stuff. Oh, we'll hit her up with the repair real quick. You know what? I feel like we're approaching the end. You know, I 
probably don't have the things I want to do on my gun. So we're not going to do that. And I was going to say, screw it. I'll just throw the end thing on my assault rifle. So I have something other to use out of the sniper rifle, <laughs> but I, I don't have it. The only way in here. The other ones have always had a back way in here. Um, Winking streams and discord. And I don't know why. Um, pick you up, pick you up, you, 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 all of you. I must have it done. So why was this barred? Or is it just to make me be all fancy and go around back? Maybe all cartridge? What was this melee weapon? The normal thing. I guess I don't read the name of things enough when I just spam loot. Looked weird. What was that? Anti riot here. Not special in any way, shape, or form. Unbar, open. The whole starving to death thing isn't all it's cracked up to be on the upside. The bathrooms are cleanest I've been since we left port. It's made my job a hell of a lot easier. Sodial engineer. Okay. Anything hiding up there? Nope. On top of that locker? Nope. Um, I did see it, everyone. It's right here. Why is this so familiar to me? I feel like maybe I was here well before. Or is there some other place that has this exact same building? I th oh, it's the sister ship of the derp. Of course, they're going to be mirrored. Interesting way to reuse assets then. So I kind of have a feeling I know the layout of the ship better than I probably should. Uh, I did this upper part in the other ship. It all makes sense now. Yeah, yeah, yeah I see you down there. Use terminal hack, uh, power down sentries, target systems to UDL. I want to, but I also want the combat XP for fighting them. So I didn't remember that's up here because that's an experience farm thing for me here. Because I can turn all these things on the UDL. Nasty people. Cigarettes. People clean up after themselves. It does seem like someone was alive and unfrozen when all this shit was going down. Um, finding a lot more blood around the ship lately. This must have been the clumsiest crew on the record. You know how hard it is to get blood stains out of steel, huh? I'm going to run out of antiseptic wash. With the amount of time I've spent on these floors, I'd better have a promotion waiting in Halcyon. Chief Custodial Engineer. Um, kind of weird. Why is there so much blood all over the place? Who the hell, man? So I'm actually stealthed in here? Why? Um, continue, message exchange, T1. Hey Rez, yeah, board up from the round of tort. Board? Up for a round of torts? I got it. Yeah, but I've got bridge duty. I'll come up, buzz me in. Sure, don't cheat this time. Listen. It's not cheating if you don't get caught. <laughs> I mean, it is. I'm inspecting the deck all the same. Okay, you know what? I will find Alex and play with him instead. Ouch. Automated audio transcript. Oh, fuck. My... Oh, oh, my fuck. Sh sorry, it's hard to be quiet. Well, try if you get picked up by the computer. We're on record forever. Is that so bad? I've gotten someone waiting for me in the pods, Alex. It's a one-time, one-trip thing. Ah... Someone's having an affair with who is awake because their partner is sleeping. That's pretty fucked up. And I'm sure it's frowned upon in this society. But, yeah, more power to you guys. Do what you want to do. I don't personally care. Great work. Um, open you. You open. Dealing stuff. On down here. Stuff to steal. The combat drone has a killer. Access restricted. 
Access restricted my ass. I guess I didn't really see what key card I used to open this. Hey Mega Sprat, how's it going? Go down with you, Mega Sprat. I don't care. That's the last of them. You got dropped pretty hard there, Mega Sprat. Could have been friends. Totally would have brought you on board. Had to do his nice little pet, but Should no. Oh, oh gosh. I'm gonna be sick. Oh, hey. Cryopods here? Or is there something out this window that I'm not paying attention to that I should be? I don't know where the bodies are here. Got cryopods? We do. We got a like, surgical table set up here and pods emptied. I mean, I agree this is kind of fucked up looking. I don't know what in the void just happened, so I'm writing it down in case I'm going insane. Pulled a guy out of a pod and his arm got all clammy. Rubbery almost. I poked at it for a bit and it started to fucking liquefy like it was made of water. Stuffed him back in quick as I could, but the rest of him ain't in a good way. Don't think he'll make it. This better not be a fucking trend or after all this we're gonna starve anyway. It's Frank. Okay, so they're trying to dethaw people and people are liquefying. We kind of knew it was going to be an issue here. Um, so, these are people are all dead. Kind of unfortunate. Uh, ah, you can't go through this. It's still lootable. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Random elevator. Kind of curious what's up with that. Um, what do we got here? Warning on our access one room termination of Halcyon. Status power report. Archive vlogs. Status. Current storage normal. Current pod count 9,999. I wonder if that's the one I got taken out of. Vlogs. Pod removal. Occupation dig fig removed. Unknown crew member. Walls. Um, automated audio transcript. Unknown crew members. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever. Just to keep them from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. So, it's actually from the intro. Right. And a little tidbit there. I mean, being place. I'm fine. Why wouldn't I be? Um, New Hope Bridge key card. That's going to be useful. Sub Sentry Guardian. Authorized personnel. Yeah. Am I really authorized personnel, though? That's the question you got to ask yourself. Um, remote communications through the un route communications through the unreliable. Can you hear me, Captain? I have successfully integrated myself into the Hope's comm systems, and am attempting to establish contact with the Hope's more primitive processor now. Would you like me to play a mood suitable music selection while you travel to the bridge? Oh, sorry. I mean, I would have. That would have been awesome. Logs, automated audio log. Whoa. Begin audio log. Is this thing working? I said begin audio. Damn it. Uh, this is uh, this is P. Williams. Wells. Yes, let's go with that. Work continues on the test subject 112. Treat from hibernation by 8. Time of extraction, oh, let's say two and a half hours ago. Time of death, six minutes prior. Explosive cell death, my arch nemesis, haunting me every attempt to revive our frozen colonists, making a mockery of my procedures. I've tried every combination of every chemical available to me, attempted every variation of every possible thawing procedure, a gradual melt, a flash thaw, um, extremities first, brain first. Don't know how much more of this I can take. Four hours of sleep in the last 72 can still hear the screaming in my nightmares. Yeah, I bet that really sucks. Test subject one, uh, 112, real name Harley Salmon, age 39, and enjoying singing. I'm so sorry, Harley. I couldn't save you. Um, begin audio log. As soon as I say the words begin audio log, what a ridiculous, inconvenient program. What happens if I just accidentally say the phrase audio log? Don't know why I'm taking talking to a frozen colonist. You're losing it. Phineas, focus, focus, come on, make the incision. 
There we go, excellent. Well, well, my frigid friend. You disobeyed the memor memorandum on ingesting food 36 hours prior to hibernation, didn't you? Thank the laws for disposable gloves. Steady now, steady. Oh, that's not good. That's definitely not good. Damn slippery scalpel. Who makes these things anyway? Spacer's choice. All right. I've got no choice. I'm going in. So he was here trying to dethaw people on his own and testing with the humans. Um, not ideal. Not looking good for your case there, my friend. But if you're trying to save the people, I don't know. It's whatever. Manual log Dear diary everyone is running around trying to figure out how we're going to eat But one of it means anything if I can't keep us on course. It's hell charting 26 years of travel through spaces I don't know if I can handle it. It's just so much pressure so many lives if I get one thing wrong one sm smudge decimal point off by one Miscalculation we could crash into an asteroid I keep thinking of the colonists. They just never wake up. Lucky them. Automated log. I've called you all here because the numbers on our rations are off. Off? What do you mean off? We have too many. Someone hasn't been taking theirs. Extra food sounds like a good thing, darling. Not extra. Someone's getting their food from another source. They must have stashed it somewhere. So, someone could have brought some from Earth. If they did, we need to include it in our rationing. Frank, every bit of food on this ship is to be split among all of us. It's theirs. It isn't yours to take. Isn't how... This isn't about ownership. This is about survival. We're going to run out eventually. The longer we last, the closer to getting it figured out. The shit. All right, all right. I want everyone to integrate their crew. Interrogate their crew. Find whoever's not eating their share and bring them forward. Weird. <clears throat> Perhaps there's hope yet. Mommy used to have such a garden. I grew up on her tomatoes and lemons and limes. When we left Earth, she was kind as to share a sample of seeds with me. So that, wherever we end up, I might start my own garden. Now buds grow in hydroponics. This may not be a backyard, but it's something. I remember every day, Mama, now. So someone's growing their own food. Um, Ma helped me, it worked. I'm going to hell, but it worked. Now, how the fuck do I break this news to the captain? What worked? Captain, wanted this on record. Sick of the witch hunt. It's me. I haven't been eating my rations. Why? Don't need it. I don't, I don't need it. Don't mind feeling hungry. I need my chief engineer at the full facilities. I'm glad you owned up to this, but for the start eating your full share, that's an order. All the respect, Cap, we're eating up Shit's Creek. Eating up shit creek. I'm not sure that's an order. It means a lot right now. It holds weight now more than ever, Frank. We need to stay organized. Well, I ain't going to do it. So either shove that shit down my throat yourself or give me my leftovers to somebody else. Okay. Get all aggressive about food before we're even here. Or there's even a food shortage. <laughs> um... Why are we just engaging the robots? Damn. I guess, I guess this is how we're thrown down. Usually they say you have a chance to uh, get your shit back. How the hell did that thing go? I mean, my mouse is too sensitive in this game. Could turn it down. That would be the smart move. But. Can we just sit here doing things, power poor robot? Get back up, I love. The vicar it wasn't even Pavel who went down. I don't know why I thought she went down. We are having a catastrophic failure of our stealth here. Looks like I'll be full clear in this place after all. What is killing everyone out there? I'm just trying to loot things. One of these robots really put that much pressure on you guys? Damn single robot. I've seen you take down Manta Queens by yourselves. Apparently these things are stronger than Manta Queens. I feel like the nature wouldn't be that big of an issue then if these things are so damn powerful, right? Whatever. Who am I to try and make sense of things? Free loots, because everything is dead. 
Do do do. Um, it should be back the way we came because that's the up top bit. Why is my aim so off today? There we go. Of course, I say there we go, like getting two shots in a row really means you fix the problem. I don't know, people. I do stupid things all the time. That's the door we unlocked. Come in here. It should be the security checkpoint. It should be the little... Oh, they, they built that then? That window there? Because there isn't a window here. Um, then you have the security office here. Oh, they blow out these walls and stretch things out. Um, but they did say it's the slimmer, more trimmed down version of this ship. So that does kind of make sense. But you know what, everyone? We are out of time for this episode. I really do appreciate y'all stopping by. And if you enjoyed this video, feel free to check out the playlist that will be appearing above me here shortly. Or just go check out my channel in general and watch all the videos front to back. It's the biggest help you can do to the channel. Thumbs up, like, subscribe, all that stuff. Super important to the analytics. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Dig figure out!